I offer these every week, along with a short teaching. Just click the subscribe link below to be notified through YouTube when I post the recording of the latest one. Or if you'd like to join me live, which I'd really welcome, go down into the description section below and follow the link along to be able to sign up for free. I'm Rick Hansen, and I'm very glad to be here. I was absent last week, though we had a wonderful guest teacher. I was visiting um, the birthplace of my father and where he grew up on a ranch in a very remote area in the Badlands of North Dakota. And it was, in some senses, a homecoming for me. And I want to add that meditation in practice is a homecoming as well. In meditation, which we'll enter into in a moment, we come home to ourselves and we stay home. <laughs> we, we get to know this home and increasingly become grounded in the deeper homes that underlie the more superficial everyday chatter of the mind. And uh, in that homecoming can be, and usually is, some restfulness and easing and uh, often a growing insight that frees us up, insight into the repetitive patterns of our own minds so we can become increasingly light and loose and free in our relationship to them. So I'm glad you're here. Let's meditate. To begin, find a posture, a way of sitting or standing or walking or lying down that helps you to be both comfortable and alert. Take care of your body. I have a little cold, so from time to time I may sip a little tea from my throat. It's okay. Uh, settle in. In this settling in is a deep principle of practice that's foundational, of being kind to ourselves. Recognizing what our body needs, recognizing what our emotional being needs, and, and doing what we can, gently, to be good to ourselves. Let yourself settle in. It's helpful to get in touch with your body if that's comfortable for you. If not, you might be aware of the room you're in or an image or a word or a feeling like gratitude or love. I'll speak of the body you can be in touch with breathing. And seeing what it's like, even as a kind of experiment, to give your attention to the feeling of breathing, breath after breath. seeing what it's like to disengage from little trains of thought that would otherwise carry you away.
feeling the air flowing in through your mouth or nose, flowing down the airway into your lungs. your chest filling as you inhale. And then softening as you exhale with air flowing out. You might like to gently count the next 10 breaths and use this counting to help you stay with them, each one from beginning to end. And if you lose track, you can start over and if you get to 10, before I offer another suggestion, well, if you like, you can start over again. Here we go. As you let attention sink into your body, you can let your mind become quieter, deliberately disengaging from planning or worrying or stressing. Broadly, shifting out of doing into being. If you like, you can continue counting the breaths to help you stay present or stay aware of breathing or some other object of attention such as an image or a feeling or a word. And as you settle in, see what it's like 
to let go. With each breath, letting go of doing. Letting go of pressure of any kind. Any pressure to get somewhere or to be someone. Letting go of this. When you let go of everything, what remains? As you let go into a growing stability of presence, it can help to have a sense of spaciousness, openness, maintaining a posture in which you can sit erect, be erect, a wideness, an edgelessness, to consciousness. You might explore that as part of a deepening stability of present moment awareness.
As you meditate, you might become particularly aware of a growing sense of stillness, finding, for example, what in your mind is already fairly still and quiet, connecting increasingly with that, abiding as stillness, a stillness that is rested in being and is not pursuing becoming, is not reaching for anything, instead is receiving, receiving whatever is occurring as it passes on through. Stillness, openness.
See if you can find enjoyment in stillness. Unpressured, undefended, unimplicated, unobligated, stillness. In the stillness, see if you can also find an openness of heart. Perhaps spreading outward. A natural kindness and stillness and openness. at home in these, kindness, stillness, openness.